I need piety. So maybe patronage would be the one to go for there. Yes. I think that probably was a good one. We need to we need to restore our piety a little bit. Okay, we'll focus on that one for now. Um I don't have money to give gifts. That's just gonna have to take some time, unfortunately. But how about You start finding secrets in my court, because hopefully that's going to allow me to start getting people's, uh, people's favor again. Cosmos, thank you very much for the subscription there. I misread Mercy as Merke, so the dyslexia uh, fun times are here as well. Hello, <laughs> Comrific. I did that a couple of times, so, yeah. Oops. Uh, right. In terms of our actual levies, oof, this is this is not great. I'm not gonna lie, it's actually kind of nasty. Um, having both of these would cost me more than I can maintain, so I am going to drop both of the light footmen. Yes, destroy that army, please. That is going to both reduce the amount of gold I need um, passively, but also I will be able to sustain having that army active. Let's drop my, my strength a little bit, but we're just going to have to see how it goes. All right. uh, not endorsed by the Archbishop. We're working on it. You can declare wars. Not going to be doing that for a while. Um... Fourth in line for Poes. I mean, I'm starting to think maybe I should have gone, gone schemes. Started wiping out my, uh, my, my nieces and nephews. Oh my lord, this game does bad things to you. Wow. Unfortunately, you're just not good at anything that I need. You're really not good enough at anything I need, so... We're just going to have to hope that we can restore some things. Um, okay, so with that done, I need to educate my children. Oh, no, you've already... Oh, thank you, Dad. Thank you, thank you Dad, me. I've already uh, got them, guardians. They're already being taught. Good. All right, time to uh, move. I'm just gonna have to spend some time consolidating our position. All the glitters. My spy master approaches me with a wicked grin. My lord, this pouch contains a powder most nefarious. It's sprinkled on top of something, say a gift for Prince Edwal. It leaves no trace, but will afflict whoever touches it with weakness and ill humor. He will have no gold of mine. Uh, or... The prince gains not feeling well for seven years. Health, severe penalty. I mean... What I could do is go to war, force him to be a knight... ...while he's sick. There's more ways of skinning a cat than... ...having a spy master skin the cat. On the plus side, we are going to be able to play around with schemes. Because as much as I, I was... Uh, you know, had Rodri built for it. I just didn't do it. Uh, oh no. <gasps> yes, scoundrel scallywag you. Problem is, he's probably got more, more troops here. He almost certainly has. Uh, two members. Both of you are scoundrels. Wretched scoundrels. Uh, okay, well. This is a pain in the bum, but... Uh, 
God, there's something wrong. My humans have been unbalanced ever since I helped you pack that gift. Oh no! What could have? The poison cold. <laughs> That's what you get, me, for being such a scoundrel. Ah. That is hilarious, though. I like that that is the thing that happens. Oh, I, I'm approving of all of these stories. One of my agents has acquired a deadly spider and arranged for a servant to hide it in Prince Edward's bed before dark. All they need is my go-ahead, and he will be as good as dead the moment the spider strikes. Um, no. This is not the way to do it. No, we're gonna we're gonna keep waiting until the time is right. While performing his studies as my spy master, has uncovered a secret held by my lover. He enjoys the intimate company of other men. Well, I. Oh, oh, right. Unlike me, however, Selif has not done a good enough job of covering up his sins. <laughs> I mean, what? I... I don't even. I just don't even. I... Okay. Uh, is no longer an agent in our scheme. Well, that does suck a bit. Has finished. I think... We need to stop this task for now. We can always come back to it later. Abandon that task. There are other people that I, I need murdered. And none of them are it yet. Mostly, I just need to find friends. Feels sad to put it that way, but it's true. While performing his duties, my spy master has uncovered a secret held by my wife. My very own wife has taken Chess Shall Shall the Og I'm literally tripping over my tongue so much today. Uh Taneshwog, a nobleman from Shandridnod as a lover. The outrage. She has no money. I oh wait, I can't I can't get money off her anyway. Damn it. I've been corresponding with your Chancellor, and I must say that I've come to see you in a light. Perhaps you are even someone that one day I would be proud to call my friend. Uh, okay, well that's actually not too bad. At least we've got some allies. Uh You raiding my stuff or your stuff? Ha! Huh. Get wrecked, half brother. Hmm. There are now four members on that that team. That is ungood. I can't. I don't think. Uh, Anorout is going to last very long, I'm going to be honest. Uh, Start trying to sway you. Being raided. Raiders from Jarl Ivar in your territory. Raise your armies and defeat them in battle. Dangerous faction. A faction has enough military power and will send an ultimatum soon. Once a faction is strong enough, their discontent rises until finally they send an ultimatum. Okay, well, that is unfortunate. Actually, can I have them? Well, I should raise next, then, maybe. Okay. How big is that army? I find out. That is a really, really big army, actually. I think 
uh, it would probably be best if I didn't get involved. If I'm, if I just allow my, uh, that to happen, is that going to affect me or my vassals? Maybe I'll die and get to play as a nicer brother. Yeah, that might happen. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. There is no way I could handle that, that army. There's just absolutely zero percent chance. Now, the right to rule Wales belongs to Earl Tudwal of uh, Amthig. By divine right, and we have gathered the support required to make it so. Accept this fact peacefully, or we will make you do so by force. I guess I have no choice. Now, you lose only dread. You become a vassal of Prince Tudwal. Every faction member gets a weak hook on Prince Tudwal. Um... Becomes independent, gets Kingdom of Wales, Prince Mervyn becomes Prince Tudwell's vassal, amongst other things. I will not be threatened. What do you think, chat? Should we go out in a blaze of glory? Because I'm fairly certain we can't win this fight. Yeah, they get hooks because they helped impress his claims. Uh, do I have allies? Is a good question. I have... Yeah, but they're very far away. There is no way they're coming to our rescue. Absolutely none. Blaze of glory. You'll keep going regardless. That is a good point, actually, yeah. Okay. I will not be threatened. No, no, slow down. Due to the war between you, you can no longer sway Prince Kadesh. To my liege, your ruthlessness is enviable. You are a pretender and a tyrant. It's time to restore the rightful monarch to the throne. Their military strength is superior to yours. Yeah, but it's because it's four of them. Scoundrels, though, yeah. Right. right, time to raise the armies. Pop. Let's just hope they filter in slowly. I'm really hopeful that they end up having to fight the raiders as well, because that could be good time. Espionage deviancy. While performing his duties as my spy master, has uncovered a secret held by my knight, Cadward. The ways in which he seeks pleasure is revolting for any decent man to even think. And yet he does not really he is not really willing, but eager. It seems so unnatural and sickening. No, it is unnatural. Uh very well. Right. As soon as I have enough peeps, I will try get down here and take some of them on, but I kind of worry that that's not going to happen easily. Uh, how about I meet you over here? Oh, they're coming back to me, but that should do. Now, I strongly suspect we're going to lose this one, but especially because they're going to join in in a moment. But at least my uh, marshal, who I kicked out of the council, is still fighting for me. I, I guess there's some small victory we can take from that.
I love how the animations change though as the the fight goes on. Okay. A nobleman was slain during the Battle of Arari. Or oh, Arari. Um. Mercenaries. If you're losing a war, you may tip the scales in your favor by hiring mercenaries. Mercenaries cost gold. <laughs> but we'll provide you with a significant army. Once employed, you'll be able to control them like you would any other army. You might want to hire a mercenary for your current war while you go into debt hiring them. We recommend that you find an affordable one unless you're losing the war badly. Okay. How much would it have cost, though? Way more than I have. I mean, I could have gone into debt, I suppose, but... Um. What if I don't want to hire a mercenary band, though? It might be saying, no, no, you, you really, really should. There, there's no chance to survive, make your time. One to three for three years contract. You cannot go into debt greater than two years of your income. Oh man, that sucks. <laughs> Being told that hurts. Ah, uh, no, no, no! You can't, you can't, you can't go into this much debt. There's no way you could afford that. No one's gonna lend you that much credit, man. Empty council position. Well, yes. My, my scallywag brother has turned on me. Um, defeat. Slaughter. Yeah. Yeah, that was a bit rough. Increase opinion. I would love to. Can I go back here? No, I don't control these guys anymore, do I? Can I not get over there? No, I do not control them at all. They're just running away now. Can we get back there without dying? No. Uh, let's try and move around the people who are chasing me down. I have to move faster. No. To the cocky king and around. You are weak and I am strong. There is no other justification needed for me to come and take what I wish from you. Well, I... <sighs> Rally the non-existent troops. Rally all of them. Damn it, it's Prince Idwal. <laughs> Having his revenge. Well done, Prince Idwal. I'm secretly hoping you win. Not so much of a hope, though, honestly. More of a reality that Idwal is going to win. There's not a whole lot that we can do to stop it. Oh, my lord. Allied combatants captured. Yeah. Enemy ally joins the wall. The wall, rather. Yeah. Neighboring ruler won a war. Yeah. And under siege. Kinda sucks. I am not gonna lie. We lost everyone there. We've got like a couple of knights, I guess. Karma is incredibly vicious, but this is this is a good story. <laughs> this is a this is a good thing to realize. Being raided. War for Prince Tudwal. I mean I could white peace, I suppose. No, will not accept. Just just wants to completely destroy me now. I kind of respect that. Surrender. There's nothing we can do other than just be killed. Go Edwald, the one true king. He is the Jon Snow of this story. He is. Truly.
Greetings, King Anorout. Despite our best efforts, my agents have yet to uncover the secrets here at court. I do not believe we will ever find anything either. Uh, okay. Uh, very well, you know best. Uh, no, actually, keep going. Uh, I should at least try and pick someone to raise the uh, loyalty off. But yeah, that that was that was pretty brutal, honestly. Can't even scheme. Oh yeah, it's because I'm at war with him. That would explain it. That is definitely pretty brutal. When we took the throne, everyone wanted us dead. I wonder how you try and orchestrate it so that your heir does not have that many enemies. There must be a way. Either that, you just leave them in such a strong position. Really, I don't know why you're raiding. Oh, actually, no, you're probably not raiding, are you? Being raided, being raided. So many people are raiding me. I mean... Where are they and what are they doing? Oh, they're sieging down here. Oh, well, that's fine. We're going to see how this plays out. Oh! Took hostage. Oh, right, took myself. Okay. Uh, that's fine. Keep it up. New Archbishop. A courtier killed in the siege. Oh, wow. Taking no prisoners. Courtier's captured in the siege. Seep of Abervau lost. Your counselor is like, finally, finally that bishop isn't there anymore. Not that the new one really uh, has a better opinion of me, but you know, it's not terrible, it is. This is the video game version of This Is Fine. No, this is absolutely the video game version of This Is Fine. At this point, again, I'm using this run to see how it how it um, plays out. Um, so I'm ex experimenting a lot here. So I actually don't... I, I find this quite enlightening. I'm now a mere duke. War for Prince Tudwal's claim on the Kingdom of Wales. To my liege, your great appetites are renowned throughout the world. This war has gone on for for too long, and I am glad to put an end to it. I accept your surrender. The claimant takes control of the contested title. Okay. Every faction member got a weak hook on uh, the prince. Became independent. Independent rulers have no liege, and thus enjoy greater freedom of action. Um, and get Kingdom of Wales. You became a vassal. Prince Mervyn became Prince Tudor's vassal as well. So be it. My expressive son and heir, I almost read that as expensive, Rodri has been released from his imprisonment at the hands of King Tudor and is free once again. Imprisonment is a cruelty. I mean... Maybe I should have just accepted it right from the beginning, but oh well. Okay, the following faction that targeted you has disbanded. Faction to install King Tudor in of Wales in the Wild Throne. I guess one of the things I should have done is try to ensure that no... Like, Tudor was getting very powerful over here and I didn't curb that. So it, it came back and bit me in the bum when then Tudor decided, oh, actually, you know what, I want all the things that Anna Raud had. Honestly, Tudor was probably in a better position to do it, but, you know. Um, increase opinions. Just increase Prince Itwal's opinion of you. Yeah. Airline to inherit uh, titles. I need to start uh, being a real schemer now if I want to do anything with my life. But I kind of like this, though. This is an interesting story. But I feel that, in a way, Rodri was a much better person not to need scheming. I only took it because he had a high intrigue. But I should have focused on a lot of other things rather than intrigue. Because it's now that I need entry, because I'm not strong. Rodri was strong and could have just taken things. Anaraud is weak and disliked. So it comes down to 
being cunning about it. But okay, let's find out what I uh, what I own. Oh, okay. So, Empire of Britannia, Kingdom of Wales, the Shore Counties in the Duchy of Gwynedd. Uh, my liege, King Tutuwal of Wales, Autonomous Vassal, oh, okay. Only thing I have is Anglesey. Oh, that's interesting. I haven't seen this one before. So I assume the darker purples are higher levels of development. Oh no, they're lower. So this is much higher. Oh yes. Oh wow, yes. 21, my lord. Okay. Uh, counties. Yeah, I just have Ang Anglesey now then. On the plus side, that's made the things a lot easier. And now, uh, now Tudwal needs to deal with all of the raiders. There's a little part of me that's a bit happy about this. Uh, I don't have any vassals, so it really doesn't matter that much. But maybe I should go to direct vassal opinion. But upgrading would be... I'm assuming upgrading would be a lot harder than downgrading. Yes, the cost would be 156, and that is going to be... Uh, actually, it's not too rough for me. I should have perhaps passed that law earlier. And just downgraded as quickly as I could. So, let's have a look at you. What do you control? Two titles. You've got... Oh! So I've still got Gwyneth. I've still got Gwyneth. I, I could have... Yeah, maybe I should have uh, immediately just, just handed it over. Might have been worth it. Okay. Well, this isn't actually as, dra as 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 bad as I thought, then. Uh, we'll finish off that. But All right, okay, so I'm learning quite a lot from this. Right, who do I need? Don't want you. Okay. Diplomacy. Are you my vassal? No, you can't be. You you couldn't possibly be my vassal. I'm sure of it. No, you are. Okay. So my vassal simply fought against me. Alright, so this this is not working nearly in, in the in the way that I, I was expecting. But this is actually pretty cool. This is working very differently from what I was expecting. Um, don't need to get you in there, but having you there would help me out a little bit because it would pull down some dislike towards me. Is there anyone else in my court that really needs to be somewhere? I kind of feel bad about you. I really do. But tis what tis. How much I can do about it right now. <laughs> Prince Edwell. Darn it, Prince Edwell! What does Prince Edwell, what is Prince Edwell good at? Actually, not bad at espionage. Uh, 
But I'm not going to give up the amazing, absolutely just ridiculous spy that I've got. That would be silly. I do need a court physician, though. I do need a court physician, yes. Um... Did we lose our last court physician? Oh, that's what you got. Might leave your court. He will stay if you given a reason, such as an employment as a knight or a counselor. Okay, well. Could I get you to be my court physician? No. Not just court physician. I will pay you some money. There we go. Alright. Maybe we've still got uh, Grigor then. 